Spider-Man. It's Yuri. Fisk make it to Rikers yet? Not Rikers. Our boy qualifies for the VIP treatment. He's in the raft. Ah, joining Scorpion, Electro, and the rest. This should be honored. That's a steam company. Can you swing by the precinct? Got an issue that could benefit from your unique skill set. For you, Yuri, anything. I'm on my way. Huh. Looks like Jameson's got a new episode out. Wonder what my number one fan thinks about the Fisk takedown. This is Just a Facts with J. Jonah Jameson, where listeners like you discuss the issues affecting our city with Pulitzer Prize winning two times. Two time Pulitzer Prize winning former publisher of the Daily Bugle. Hey, plug the book. And, and as always, if you order Mr. Jameson's book, Spider Man Threat or Menace, within 24 hours of our broadcast, you'll get an autographed copy at no extra charge. No personalizations, don't ask, not gonna get it. Welcome to Just the Facts with J. Jonah Jameson, alerting you to the threats you don't even know about. Let's dive right into the calls. Speak. Okay, so not for nothing, you gotta give Spider-Man respect for taking down Wilson Fisk, right? I mean, one last pop boss is good for everything. Is that right? Tell me, are you a police officer? A prosecutor? Maybe an award-winning reporter with decades on the job like me? Uh, no, I'm a plumber. Oh, good. And fix my toilet and shut up! Let me explain something to you about crime bosses. As soon as one goes down, every punk with a gun, a tracksuit, and a drawer full of gold chains decides he's the next godfather. We're gonna have a gang war in the streets, but does that whip headed moron give a damn? Of course not. He got on TV. That's what counts. <laughs> yeah, well, I can get copper pipe without paying kickbacks. So until that gang war starts, I'm on the web head side. And you'll be singing a different tune. Now that you quit smoking, what do you tell people when you come up here? That I need a break from their crap. 